Many local colleges have announced they'll be holding in-person commencement ceremonies. That's good news. Our Taylor Musgrove joins us now. She's down in Indianola at Simpson College to tell us more. Good morning, Taylor. Good morning, Andy. You know, Simpson isn't just holding an in-person commencement for their 2021 graduates, but also those who graduated in 2020 who weren't able to have an in-person graduation last year. Now, both of these ceremonies will be held on May 1st in Simpson's Buxton Stadium. And if it rains, Simpson says they will move these events inside of their field house. Now, 2020 graduates will walk at 10 a.m. and the 2021 graduates later at 2 p.m. Each student will get four tickets and social distancing will be enforced with families asked to sit in pods and all attendees will be required to wear masks. Now, like many local schools, Simpson has a crisis management team that has been coming up with mitigation strategies on campus. Kathy Cole, a member of this team, says these graduations are the first step for Simpson to return to regular protocols. I think this is a return to our new normal. Um, I think you'll be seeing a lot more activity on campus. We're really looking forward to having some um, camps on campus this summer. And I really do think this is this is a symbol. Now, 2020 graduates have until next week to let Simpson know if they will be walking this year. But Cole said that they really aren't pressed for space as they have around 2,000 undergraduates here and they have about 5,000 seats in that Buxton Stadium. So they're just really happy that they get to give this opportunity to those 2020 graduates. My graduation ceremony at Drake was outside. My poor grandfather was sunburned for like two weeks after that. Thanks, Let's Taylor. not talk about Drake, Andy. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Go Bulldogs.